We are tracking another tense situation. Iranian-backed militants hijacking a cargo ship in the Red Sea. 25 crew members taken hostage. Those militants claiming the vessel seized in international waters has ties to Israel. ABC's Marcus Moore reporting in tonight. Tonight, Yemen's Houthi rebels releasing a video showing their fighters hijacking a commercial cargo ship in the Red Sea in support, they say, of the Palestinian people. A helicopter is seen landing, unloading Iranian-backed militants who swarm the deck, then make their way to the bridge where the crew appears to surrender with their hands in the air. Tonight, officials say the ship and 25 members of the international crew are being held hostage. The Houthi rebels seen moving through the ship, chanting for the sake of Gaza, claim the galaxy is an Israeli vessel. But the ship is British-owned and operated by a Japanese company, and officials say there are no Israelis on board. The galaxy leader, last seen after it was hijacked, surrounded by Houthi boats, sailing with the Palestinian and Yemeni flags. The State Department calling it a violation of international law. We demand the immediate release of the ship and its crew, and we will consult with our allies and UN partners as appropriate on next steps. David, the Japanese government is negotiating for the release of that ship and its crew. The Houthis say the ship is being taken to Yemen's western coast, and tonight they claim this is just the beginning of their battle at sea. David. Marcus Moore reporting from Beirut tonight. Marcus, thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.